Cubs anymore. Here's the pitch from Florence. It's another strikeout. Stretch, wind up pitch. Swung on, missed. Another one goes down by the kick. No one tagging the bags for Ohio State. As Robinson goes down, it's one, two, three by way of the K for Nathan Florence. Here's Ohio's recent field, uh, field roster. Sent out to right center, back towards the wall. Did he make the catch? They say he did. What a play by Neister. Rob Dezenzo. Good pitch count, good strikeout count, just an all around great performance, exactly what you want to see. Two runners on for Rutgers. Escoupe sends it at Neister. Cracked out to center field. Kern makes the throw into the plate. It's off target. Brookman went to track saying, ready for this payoff with the bases loaded. Sent towards Lasco. It's cracked out to center. All the way back. Kern's tracking it. Gives up on it. It's gone. Grand slam from Ryan Lasco. Blows this game open. Six wow. to two, six to one. Rutgers ahead. What a piece of hitting to deep center field for Lasco. And this game, like you said, Caleb, blown wide open. Allowed a grand slam to Ryan Lasco that blew this game open. And now with the bases loaded, a hit out to right field thrown in. It's going to record one run and a second as two Scarlet Knights are able to score and bump this show in the top of the sixth. Preparing for another one, cracks it out to left, sent it towards the wall, Lipsy tracking it back, makes the grab, but he couldn't get it. Lasco, another homer. Left field bomb, Lasco puts it nine to three. Well, Ryan Lasco have a day today, his second home run. Samillo facing a 2-2 even count, pops this up to left field, back towards the wall. Lipsy tracking it, watches it sail over his head. Back-to-back -back home runs for Rutgers. First Lasco, now Samillo. It's going to be 11-3 once Samillo touches the dish. What? A game from the Rutgers batters. Well, this is exactly the reason why Rutgers is number one in the Big Ten. And just as we talk about Samillo maybe having a slow game by his standards. On the one-two, there's the wind-up. Popped out to left center. Making the track is Kern. It's over the wall. Another homer. Third of the inning for Rutgers, and no doubt that spells the end of the day for Gehring as Schiekhofer takes his round. Yeah, it's been just a prolific day. Dominant performance at the plate from the center fielder. And his batting average took a nice jump as that one's cracked out to left center. Could it be home run number three? Yes, it is. Heads out into the football practice field. Someone asked Ryan Day to get that back for us as Lasco puts up his third out of the park bomb in this game. 